here after the ADXC press conference with one of the main pioneers of MMA in the Middle East, Mr. Tariq Islaiman. Always a pleasure to see you. Pleasure to see you. Pleasure to be here. Tariq, I would like to know your thoughts about what you just heard. I don't know if you knew what ADXC was before coming. Actually, I didn't know. And uh, from what I saw, it's amazing. Like, this is all about what my style is. Uh, a lot of grappling inside the cage. I come from an MMA background, but with a lot of jujitsu knowledge. So uh, to see this happening in uh, the martial arts capital of the world, like something is really exciting. And with the format and how, how the event is done and with the level of the names uh, present, uh, presence in the press conference, it gives us a lot of uh, uh, like idea of what's going on. And uh, I know you're into MMA now, but it, is it... Uh a platform where you would be interested in competing in? To be honest, this is when I heard the, the, the format and how things is done, like it's, uh, I think it's a, na a natural progression for my career uh, to transition from MMA into the grappling, which has always been my passion. Uh, I've been doing it for 15 years now. Uh, I've been black belt for three years. So it's, uh, it's the nat natural progression for me to jump, to dip and test myself uh, into this part of uh, games. It's very close to MMA. It will, I, I think, I believe that I have the advantage over other jiu-jitsu athletes using the cage and the footwork that they're not used to, uh, to compete on the mat naturally for them. Uh, but for me, it will be uh, a lot easier to use the cage, to use the walls, the footwork, the cutting corners pinning them to the uh, to the fence and use the fence to my advantage to take them down and like hurt them basically because uh, from what I saw uh, they promote a lot of aggression into the grappling uh, uh, format um, obviously no hitting so I will be walking into the danger with uh, with open hands and <laughs> welcoming hands I think so uh, I think very exciting for me yeah and when it comes to all the different types of grappling when sambo judo wrestling which one do you think will be dominant in, in like we're going back as if we're in the early MMA days, but fast forward into a more innovative way. I know now it's uh, the sport evolved so much and uh, people have a lot of uh, like knowledge about all martial arts. I think I believe that MMA fighters with big uh, background in uh, Jiu Jitsu will have the biggest uh, advantage here because uh, they do have the advantage of using the cage and uh, the footwork. Also, like we are in our environment. It's not the otherwise, uh, the vice versa. We're not into their territory on the mats and they know how to use the rules because I competed in jiu-jitsu uh, before, but I didn't know the rules and the point system and they probably they won over me with advantage. And here there's no advantage. The only advantage for us is being aggressive, know how to use the the parameters of the the cage so it's exciting but i'm looking forward to seeing you in the adxc cage. <laughs> likewise thank you thank you adxc abu dhabi extreme championship